Hey everyone, happy Friday. Can you check Leon in the back? Is he not the cutest little snowman? I love him. Anyway, it's Friday morning, very early, and I'm just up and ready and excited for the day, and I was pondering on this. I was thinking, Victoria, you always have so much energy, and I was trying to think back of, you know, whenever I was in junior high, high school, even as a kid, like, I don't remember ever having this spark under me. I don't ever remember just being so energetic, and it's, 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 it really is because of my diet and how I take care of myself, and it's something that you can really reap the benefits from, because I can go from doing this to this to this to this, and I just, it's really, it's really awesome, and I'm not saying I don't ever have a a down moment because we all do you know but um, for the most part I'm pretty vibrant and I'm pretty happy and it's just really fun having energy it's fun feeding your body with beautiful things it's fun surrounding yourself with nature and you know all the beautiful things in life I know that sometimes negativity can just suck you right in and sometimes when one bad thing happens in your life, it's like another one happens and then another one happens and then another one happens. But, and I know that this is sometimes easy to say, but you know, the nev the negativity can suck you in. And, and I know that sometimes when something negative happens to you, you can think, Ugh, you know, why me? Why is this happening to me right now? This is the worst time, blah, blah, blah. But sometimes you just have to stop and think, you know, it just is what it is. That's the life in this physical world. Things are thrown at you in this life. This physical realm that we're in right now is definitely not perfect, but I know that each and every one of you have blessings. Number one, because you're alive. If you're alive, that's a blessing at this moment in time, you know, at any moment. Because this, like I said, this physical realm, it's it's very beautiful and there's there's a lot to offer and there's a lot of people who are not currently in this physical realm anymore and they might wish that they were. I don't know, I've never died before. You know, maybe wherever you go when you die is so beautiful and magical that you don't ever think about this physical realm anymore. Maybe that's why there's so many hardships in this world. Because it's kind of like you have to pay your dues to get to the other side and to get to the, the just the beautiful heaven or, you know, wherever. So I personally, like, okay, now we're going to go into like a deep topic here, but let's talk about death. So my mom taught me from an early age, and I thank her for this, but she always taught me to never fear death. You know, why fear it? Some people are seriously freaked out about dying, and, you know, granted I am young, so I know that anyone who's older watching this is probably like, yeah, you're young, you think you're invincible. But it really isn't because of that. I just, I don't fear death. And I know that whenever I do die, I will be going to a beautiful place with God. And yeah, so sometimes we just have to think about life like that. And think about all the positivity. And, and not take ourselves so seriously sometimes. And I know that this is, <laughs> I'm like 10 planets in Capricorn. So if anyone knows about seriousness, it's me. I'm, I'm a very serious person. And sometimes I have to remember to not take life so seriously, like I said, and to just let my hair down and to not be so darn serious all the time. But sometimes it just is what it is. And this world is crazy. And there's a lot of things that get thrown at you in this life. But there's also a lot of beautiful things. Exhibit A. I mean, let's take time to smell the daisies and to think about all the little things in life that we're so thankful for, you know? fresh water, a dishwasher, um, you know, heat and air conditioning, somewhere to live, clothes, I mean, all the little things that sometimes you can take for granted, you know? So this is a very, very random video, but I wanted to say hi to you guys, and I wanted to tell you guys that if you, let's talk about the raw food diet for a little second, um, if you guys are having any type of struggling or hardship, leave a comment down below and I will try to give you any tips that I can. And just remember that fruits and vegetables heal. They're beautiful. They're wonderful. And to me, it's the key secret to life. You know, detoxification, fruits and vegetables, getting back to nature, praying, fresh air, sunlight, all of those things are only going to make you happier and better. You know, they're not ever going to hurt you. 
So that's my little video today. I know Leon wanted to say hi too. <laughs> But I hope you guys have a beautiful Friday, beautiful weekend, but I'm sure I'll talk to you before the weekend is over. But um, yeah, so click like, comment, and subscribe. Click like if you think these are some of the most beautiful flowers you have seen lately. I mean, especially this pinky one. Oh my gosh, I love them. So I'm going to sit here and hug these flowers for a little bit, and um, I will talk to you guys later. Bye! <laughs>